served in Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just check. Checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner. <sighs> what should I cook? Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news! Come by the lab! Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool! Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. I wonder if this means I have a job again. Yes, I can stop by. Just for a minute. Okay. Oh, Spider-Man, you're a bit. I just found Vanessa in the loft. <laughs> I love these names. Is Sandra happy to see them back? Well, uh, actually, she's not with us anymore. Cancer, you know. Howard, I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. Life for living, not moving. First thing she told me after the diagnosis. Gotta remind myself of that every now and again. Keep looking, will you? Finding the rest of these birds would really mean a lot. Thanks, Spider-Man. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. Our first volunteer subject, Lance Corporal Texador. Lost his arm overseas and now just wants to hug his daughter again. Really glad Doc let me store things here after- Oh, Peter! I noticed you keep track of Spider-Man's foes. Smart. Easier to craft countermeasures that way. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. Huh. <laughs> Electro was the first legit super-powered villain I fought. Till then it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Electro was a big change. Big change. Mob enforcer turned walking tank. Rhino's racked up enough property damage to destroy Manhattan three times over. In some sad, sick way, the City Hall attack may have done some good. Norman's approval ratings are sinking. 
the people are starting to realize their beloved mayor only cares about himself. Sometimes it takes a tragedy to wake people up to the truth, to finally see the monster they themselves elected. Wish Doc wouldn't fixate on Norman like this. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Showed up with stains on my shirt, 10 minutes late from stopping a mugging. Still can't believe Doc hired me. Hope he doesn't regret it now. Running tests on carbon nanotube biocompatibility. Decent candidate for a direct tissue interface, but I feel like we can do better. Hmm, graphene. But the structure is super unique. What is this? Some kind of polymer.
Hmm, graphene. But the structure is super unique. What is this? element for a prosthetic. Doc's messing around with superconductors. Very cool. Complex oxide ceramic. Perfect type 2 superconductor. It'll run hot, but maybe good for an outboard controller? Some kind of polymer. Self-healing polymer. This stuff will survive almost anything. Parker, we've been focused on limb replacement. Connecting nerves at severed extremities, replicating the function of lost appendages. But what if instead, we gave people something they've never seen? Something straight from the mind? Unchain all of us from the bodies we've been born with, and instead, unleash the awesome power of our minds. Damn it! Why do I keep repeating the same mistake over and over? Norman Osborne cannot be trusted! In matters large and small, if Norman has the chance to profit off another man's loss, he'll take it. It's infuriating. Someday I'll turn the tables. I'll teach Norman what it is to feel helpless and small. Doc must have more history with Norman than he shared. Lots of late nights in this lab. Glad Doc keeps the snacks stocked up. We should get more of those little cheese squares, though. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it.
Ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Already? Uh, whoops. I haven't been recording this entire time. So anyway, here we go. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit. I delete these. Who <sighs> if we go like this? So that's all going on. Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? Forget I have my mic muted that entire time. I think we did it. Next step. Neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. From MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. All right, let's do this one now. Cool. Logic. 
logic controller for the micro cables Doc's been theorizing. Okay, four and four. These things are awesome. So much more of a simple AI that'll improve the prosthetics functionality over time. Alrighty, now if we just go that here, future. we make this one. I always go the largest one and work our way down. Alrighty, here we go. Two and two, dang. First try. Now the prosthetic has a tiny brain. Cool. Oh, this is a big one. Intracranial interface. This is a big one. Oh, I already did it. Revolutionary, but not a hundred percent stable. We need and to refine this design. And we got two more, and we're done. What's that? What's what? What is he talking about? Wonder if I could three D print a web. What is this stuff, Doc? Looks like armored plating. Defense prototypes. Fascinating, really. AIM has requested a number of samples of my work. Who am I to deny them my genius? Ha! Ah, kidding, of course. Hmm. All right, I think that's it. Alrighty, now let's go check out MJ. Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. Alright, so let's do some sad stuff in the meantime. Such as... Let's do this, because it's the only thing we have in this area. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. This I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. And we got one more thing to do. And of course we got crimes and stuff like that, but... I think we'll do this. This is stable control. Need a report of the situation north of Houston. Demons firing on our position. Oh yeah, we gotta be stable too, I forget about that. Okay, be careful in here, Pete. This station analyzes hazardous chemicals. And basically trying to figure out how to counteract them if they ever got out into the world, which <coughs> hopefully 
they never will. Oh no. Someone broke in and stole a volatile rocket propellant. Mm -mm. They must have cracked the container because it's leaking. From the timestamp on the security cameras, it just happened. I need to get it back. Uh oh. Yep. The get... spider bots are still just prototypes. This is a good time to test one. Its sensors can follow the chemical trail. Better than me swinging up on the thief. Spider bot. Gotta find a quiet place to deploy the spider bot where I can hang out and guide it. Spider bot, spider bot. Not only is Minnie me cleaning up the spills, it's leading me right to the thief. Minnie me. It was weird with this controller. He's hiding in crowds. On? I'll disperse him with a subsonic blast. Won't hurt anyone, but it's super annoying. Lucky this stuff's only dangerous over a long exposure. Or if it combusts. Maybe. Maybe not. Sucker fast. End of the trail. He, he's running. Gotta wrap him up with a web burst. Got him. Now to get the fuel back. Got it. Now I just need to return the fuel to the station. This little spider bot's useful. If I can ever find a way to make them cost effective, they'd be a big help. Okay. Bingo. Chemicals back where it belongs. I beefed up the station security and sent Yuri the camera footage to convict the thief. Not a bad day's work. This is one station that was already earning its keep. It should be safe from being shut down, especially now that the chemicals are locked away. Okay, we had dinner at MJ's, but still not a thing. Hey, MJ. Oh, perfect. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Peter, you are not going to believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. <sighs> MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. Okay. Lance MJ. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Oh, that was a rat. Bet it was happy. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We built this war base for Lee. Lee finances Yo, the boss's new venture. We need to get into that office. What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Careful. Don't hit the boxes. Easy does it. Don't what hit the box, MJ. This big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Yo, who's there? <sighs> that guy's not going anywhere. Maybe I can distract him. Grave dust. I heard something. What was that sound? I swear I heard something. 
someone there. Wait. Yep, yep. Read that one up. I didn't see that guy. Where is it? I swear I left it over here. I was trapped. All right, we'll try it again. Third time charm. Do we not go this way? There's the office. A lot of men in the way, though. I mean, how do we? It's going way better on my first playthrough of this game. How did that happen? That's my question. Did it go backwards in the... Oh, it must have went backwards in the gun and... Backwards in the barrel. That's what happened there? I'm not sure. And now I need a new welder. to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, 
What if we teamed up? Wait, wait, do you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. <laughs> Birded. Birded it again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh. <laughs> uh. Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Learn car quits. Right there. I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Bye-bye. And take care.